so easy to mistake in a male from a female rabbit. And I've heard so many different stories of people that think that they have two female rabbits and then come a couple of weeks later and their one rabbit is pregnant with a bunch of new kids. So today we're talking about how to actually sex your rabbits and tell whether they really are male or female. I'm Danielle of the Sweater Owl Farm and welcome to our channel where we bring you new content every week on how to start your own homestead or small farm in order to live a more self-sustainable lifestyle. So let's get started. When sexting rabbits, there are a few common errors that people usually make which lead them to deciphering the wrong gender. And one of those is that they're going to be sexing the rabbit too early. So usually you wanna wait until they're around six weeks old, depending on the breed of the rabbit and the size of the rabbit, you might wanna wait a couple of weeks more. Usually by weeks eight or nine, you're definitely gonna be able to tell the sex of your rabbit, but anything earlier than six weeks, it might be a little bit too hard. Now, as they do become adults, you're gonna be able to easily tell the difference because a lot of things are going to be dropping and getting larger. But before that, it's gonna be a little bit harder and sometimes it does take a little time and practice in figuring out which is which. And the second common mistake that you're going to see is that people do not apply enough pressure. So we're gonna go ahead and grab two rabbits out from the barn in just a bit and you're gonna notice that when you do wanna be sexing the rabbits, you are gonna to need to actually apply pressure to be able to to have their genitals actually pull out. And if you do not apply enough pressure, you might mistake a male for a female. And that is definitely a common error that I see happen all of the time. But we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna grab first a female rabbit, and then we'll grab a male to show you what the difference is between each. And we're gonna talk a little bit about it. One second. Now, <laughs> when sexting your rabbit, you're gonna want to first make sure that you're just being well friendly with your rabbits so they feel calm and safe, making sure that you're supporting both their bottom and upper half. Now, this is Stu. We've done a lot of work with Stu before and he's a great animal. He loves to be touched and held, um, but this could always not be a fun experience. So let's go. So you're just going to push down and you can see that is the male and we just have him on his back. You're gonna press down on the tail and then pull up front. And you can also kind of see here that you can see his genitals kind of dropped in there right here as well. Here is our second rabbit. So this rabbit is around 10 weeks old. So definitely old enough that we can start to sex them. And we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing. It's a little easier to maneuver a smaller rabbit for sure. The other one's probably about 15, 20 pounds. This one's more like five pounds. And they're gonna pull back their tail, pull up their front. And you can see here that it looks a lot different and we can actually throw up some pictures as well. As you can see, it can be a little bit harder to sex rabbits and it definitely does take practice and looking at a lot of pictures, their squirminess and energy definitely does not help. But I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video and I'll post up some more great videos in our rabbit playlist right here. So you definitely are gonna wanna check those out and subscribe if you aren't already a member of our community as we post new content every week and we'd love to have you along for the journey. Bye.